hearing. It'll tell you on the box. It's nasty, bro. And, and what's real, I was like, man, for a second. What's really sick about it is that's the shit when your children walk by, they see it, they want it. But, uh, yeah, I was going to say uh, about that white rice, that, that's hella bad. It's just pure sugar. It's, you know, notice when you boil it, you know, that, that end when it comes out, it's like, it looks like glue. That, that stuff, it's, it's pure glucose. It just feeds all the bad bacteria in the body. So you eat it, the, the bad bacteria eat it, and then they create that, uh, that, uh, that colony to, to makes them stronger. So that just all that starch, potatoes, all that, all that hella bad, way, way, way bad for your digestive system. I got your scripture up here. This is Ezekiel 4 and 13. And the Lord said, Even thus shall the children of Israel eat their defiled bread among the Gentiles, whither I will drive them. Yeah, God, so, so being here, you know, you can try to eat as healthy as you can, but it's impossible. Because we're in Babylon, everything's defiled. Even you get organic food, you know, it's still defiled. It's still, it's still got chemicals and shit. So, but, uh, yeah, God, so, so we're, we're going to be eating defiled bread. Hey, and that's extortion. Good. And it's these other nations extorting things. You know, making money, making money off of it. You know, you tell it, you tell it, Jake, that uh, steak and, uh, or that, uh, Shrimp, crab, and lobster is the, the staple. Like that's the, the fucking high class meal right there. And you over, you, you get crab by the by the by the bumpboats, man. You, know, you gotta pay fucking fifty dollars for some crab and shit to eat that motherfucker. And you, you think you're high class, and really they're selling you an abundance of bugs. Uh, yeah, because um. It's even worse than that, you know. Jake, Jake be eating fucking crawfish, bro. Yeah, yeah. It's just cheaper than that. Yeah, I don't know if y'all been to Las Vegas, but have you been to the Heartbreak uh, Cafes? Heart attack cafe. Heart attack. And then you make your sign waivers. Heart attack. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? They make you some huge yeah. slimy burgers. Yeah. Well. Oh, shit. You make you sign waivers, like to not have them reliable, you just fall out, man. Fall out and die. Some big ass burgers, grease, fiber lard, all types of shit. Everything that will cause your arteries to clog up, man. Right? And it's a famous place. Hey, the people love that you know, shit. In Las Vegas, man. So, the fried stuffed donut ice cream balls. Yeah, you know yeah. I mean? Double fried, triple fried, and shit. And then glazed. Yeah. We got another scripture for you, Arthur. This is a. Uh, Leviticus 11 and 9. These shall ye eat of all that are in the waters. Whatsoever hath fins and scales in the waters, in the seas, and in the rivers, them shall ye eat. Yes, so uh, uh, anything with, with fins and scales is lawful to eat. You know, you got salmon, uh, tuna, sardines, which, which those are, those are, when you taste it, they taste good. They taste, they're healthy. For you. They got uh, healthy fats, omega 3s. You know, which are anti-inflammatory, and then uh, the other fish. You know, there's like you got catfish, which is disgusting. You know, they eat all the shit on the bottom of the river, and you, you taste the meat, and it just tastes like dirt. I ate it once when I was younger, and that shit was disgusting. You know, I, I didn't like it. But you know, people nowadays they just eat it as a delicacy. Right? I mean, uh, and that's true. You got a dish, and you got to put all types of shit on it just to make it taste good. Yeah, obviously. The main thing that they that they love is scavengers, decomposers, things that are used to clean the ecosystem, right? Even the pig. They have pigs to clean the farm. They don't even have an immune system. <coughs> I don't even think a pig sweats. Dogs, so everything that is eaten, whether it be humans, whether it be shit, whether it be fish, it's all in the flesh. So when you go and eat that pig at these little, little diners, you know, everybody wants to uh, add the dollar thirty-five for extra bacon and shit. You know, they're going to get all that shit. And, uh, who knows if it was standard to cook, right? And on top of that, it's an abomination for you to eat anyway. So, you know? That's why people get gout, heart attacks, clogged arteries. That's why you're stressed out. 
That's why you feel like you have to drink more, smoke more, because you have a chemical imbalance, man. That's why you gotta be alkaline. You have to first get alkaline and then use certain herbs to get those chemicals back into balance. You can't just start taking that. Now, vitamins, I mean, vitamins work. But you can't, like, expect to cure yourself or, or uh, get super healthy just overnight. You gotta clean out your, your digestive system and all that. You're cold. That's why people do cleanses. And they work out. And then you gotta exercise. It's all after some kind of work. You know? Yeah, yeah. Uh, 80% of your immune system is in your gut. So if your gut is just full of shit, full of back to garbage that you've been eating your whole life, your body's never going to be able to heal because all that shit is just back in there. Those, those immune cells can't function on, on the level that they're supposed to be if you were eating like a healthy Because you're being overworked. You're being, you're being strained out, man. Right? Just to go back on the script real quick. Uh, yeah, like the brother said, uh, the catfish and whatnot, uh, they're slimy, you know, they, because they ain't got scales. That's why. And the law tells you they're slimy, or they're unclean. Because they ain't got no uh, fins or scales. They got, they got might have fins, but they don't have scales. So they're unclean. It's not just about how something tastes. Or about how you fix it. Because people say, oh, it's a good No, it's a spiritual